Hey everyone. No, Round four. Yeah. Uh, both cap seven. Yep. He's in play. Swap. I don't like that. That's a swap. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just it's such a rude color. I'm gonna shock myself. Okay. And I'm gonna tap it. I'm gonna play a Heartfire Hero. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna push it. Why would you push him? Yeah, I'm gonna push it. Why would you push him? He's a cute mouse. <laughs> It'll be your turn. Um. Cottage. Here. So I have a question. Yes. Do you have a second one? Uh, I don't know. Tap two? Yeah. Remember our challenge? Two two haste. He's been pushed. Such a jerk. He's pushing mice. <laughs> He's just pushing mice off cliffs. Like a, like a broom. Like a broom. Uh, your favorite card. I'm sorry. Oh? Plus, uh, Bit of a different feeling for this deck. Yeah. My turn? Yeah, you're going. Cool. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, we can. Like, oh, yeah, you can Helix? Uh, Needle Verge Pathway. For a Heartfire Hero. Mm -hmm. And a Manifold Mouse. Okay. I'm going to go to combat. Okay, I don't know what happens. I'm giving him Double Strike, which just means he's going to get a 1 1 counter from Valiant. Okay. When he dies, uh, oh, technically you're supposed to take 1 damage from him dying again. Okay. Yeah. So whenever he dies, uh, deals damage equal to his power to each opponent. Okay. Um, Please a 2 2. Pass turn. No haste, so. Field? No. Combat. Yeah. Draw a pose life, move up to three counters from target permanent. You know what? If you're willing to remove that counter instead of draw a card, lose a life, that's fine. I'll take three. Um, I'll go to 15. Uh, I will remove that counter. Okay. Um, that's a lot of money. Servant of the Yeah. Uh, you go. Yeah. He's a one three. Cool. Draw. Cool. 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 Well, it's not the card I would have hoped for that I could have potentially gotten lethal out of. But we'll see what we do. Because let's actually we'll start this way. We'll start with ancestral anger, mm -hmm. targeting my Heartfire hero. He'll get a one one counter from Valiant. He gets plus one, plus oh, because this is in the graveyard by the time it actually resolves, and I will draw a card. So, for the sake of just remembering all the any pumps, yep. uh, draw a card. That is not a another pump. Um, I will go ahead and let's see. Two, three, four, five, Mm, that touch just won't kill him, but it's such a threat, I have to do it. Um, we'll go ahead and sack Sacred Foundry. We're going to Monstrous Rage. Okay. And we'll pay a white, and we're going to squeak by on him as well. What does that do? Give him plus one, plus one, and he can't be bought for creatures pow uh, power greater than three. Three or greater. Okay. Doesn't matter because you got one one. Go to combat. Before combat. Yeah. Uh, bitter Triumph. Okay. So. He is still a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. So you'll still take seven in the face. Cool. Go to 12. Um, I did draw the card from that, so that's mm -hmm. fine. <clears throat> and then I'll pass turn. I'll sack this and target your sacred. Okay. I'll go grab a mountain. Is it basic? It's not basic type, right? It's just a basic, right? Non basic land. Or, oh, sorry. Uh, each player searches his or her library for a basic land card. Basic land, yeah. yeah. And it's untapped. Correct. Yep. I will grab a mountain. <laughs> Dude, he's always so literal. It's funny if he's not six. Let me look the 
Sounds matters that much, so yeah, I'll, I guess I'll take it, and you can go tutor. Okay. Well, first I guess you have that too, so you yep. have two triggers. So, <coughs> first strike trigger. Draw, yep. Lose a life, draw a card. Um, second strike. Yep. Uh, uh, yeah. Yep. Second, second and go oh, tutor. Well, How many cards in hand? One. <laughs> Graveyard I've had this deck yet. <laughs> land for turn. Yeah, uh, say go. That would have been so cool a turn ago. That, yeah, yeah, that could have won me the game a turn ago. Fast turn. Swing three. Lose a life draw card. Shock and finally, there's my protection. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I was like, you had the two removal spells. Surely you do not have the third removal spell. Tutor. Oh no, no, no the, the, the removal. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. No, oh, the bitter triumph. That was the. <laughs> oh. I'm like, surely you do not have the third removal spell. That's going to burn me. Yes, you did. Do I want to potentially put these in? Let's try this again. I'm gonna hope you don't have the three removal yeah. spells starting hand. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. I should probably be back at 20 without. No, exactly. 
Like, is it playable? Yes. Is it one of like my most not feel good hands? Yes. It's the first night with the deck. We're gonna run it. You good? Yeah. I'm gonna start with a Cavern Souls on Mouse. I'm gonna play my least favorite one drop mouse to play on a one drop. Pass turn. Still two one. It's a two one, but he has a sweet other ability that is real cool. It's a fable. Uh, here you go. Okay, I'm gonna shock myself. Go to 18. I'll pay two, and I will play an Emberheart. That's pretty good. Yeah, I'll go in for four. Here you go. And then he looked and looked again because he was like, oh, man, I kept it. I should have kept it. Oh, boy, howdy, does that make me feel like a weird way to play this? Oh, and then so it's three cards down. I almost would prefer it to be a land. <laughs> that is, that is uh, keeping a hand on a lot of faith there. I guess mathematically this is better. Two mana, cavern. And we will play a Manifold Mouse. Um, before combat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're going to push the yeah. Manifold. So okay. I, that gives the other mouses double, double strike. strike. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got to right. do that. Go to combat. Swing four. You got it. Go to 12. Cracking my fable. Yep. Listen here. And then I'll pass her. I'll just Supposed to be a land, Mr. Arms. <laughs> like, I love that mouse. It's honestly my favorite mouse in the deck. He's also got a sweet token. I'll grab the forest. Bam! The manifold mouse token. Oh, that's the wrong side. Foods. Okay. Drop it. Marsh. Oh, what do I want to do here? Um. Uh. Lisa seems good. Yeah. Here go. On time. Are the cards? The Cavern is both a great card in the deck and also really painful some games. Because if I fail... Okay. Yeah, I gotta do it this way. Go to combat. Yeah, yeah. Swing four. Um, <laughs> no blocks or blocks? This again. Blocks. Okay. Um, there, I guess. Okay. So, response. Mm -hmm. I will pay a white or a red. How do we want to do this? I guess I'm kind of okay with that. So, it'd be better for me to try to keep them going. So, I'm going to pay a red. And I'm going to go ahead and Monstrous Rage the Ember Heart Challenger. Sounds good. So, he's going to prowess, get yep. plus one, plus one for that, six. and get plus three, plus one from this. So, he'll be six. But. Technically, before that resolves, I will exile the top card of my library. Like that. that is at least a one drop. Yeah. Yeah. So this guy will die. Yeah. Um, you'll take six from this, and then yeah. second main phase, Cavern Souls, pay a red, yeah. play Heartfire. Yeah. Pass turn. It's good. He is good. So they all these four have plus one plus zero. That's a three three. Uh, it is now a three three. Guy, yes. <laughs> Virtue. <laughs> yeah. I go up to. Eight. Push. All right, you'll take one. Uh, combat. Take three. Go to fifteen. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Keep hurting yourself. Yes, yes. I'll go to six and draw a card. Thank you. Uh, year go. Okay. 
still not the card I want. Literally, a moment, a moment, and if that's not a fatal push, he's dead. Ember Heart Challenger. Mm -hmm. Combat. Swing two. Go to four. Pass turn. Keep cavern back. Yeah. Which pump spell do you want to take? Ooh. They're all good. Um, I have no ancestral angers in the bin. So, plus one plus O oh, trample draw a card. Plus three plus O oh, with a trample. Plus two plus two potentially indestructible. And this is just at this point these are effectively the same card. Right. I would just get rid of that. Yeah. Makes sense. Uh, Exile energy. Right. Yep. Um. I'm gonna bitter triumph. Yep. So if you if you did, you may have spent. Yeah. <laughs> uh, here you go. Okay. Draw. That's should have been more specific. Mice. That's right. The ability to Gulch. You take one. Yeah. Swing one in the air. Yep. I'll take one. You'll gain one. Uh, here you go. Um, this might be stupid, but I'm going to try it. I'm going to pay a red. And just, just to draw a card? I'm going to, yeah, give your creature trample until on a turn, mm -hmm. and it does not get plus one plus one, because I got control mouse, but I'll draw a card from that. Okay. And then I will draw for turn. Okay. That's the land. That is actually awesome. Um, Needle Verge pathway on Needle Verge. On red. No, sorry. Actually, yeah, that's fine. This one's fine. This is like Foundry works too. No, Sacred Foundry does not work. Sorry. Pathway on white. I need to keep Trump to get it. And then we will pay, I guess this way. So three for a. How many cards in? Two. Okay. <laughs> Four mana open. We're asking, we're wondering how much of a risk this is. That's for sure what we would grab. You have a blocker. You need a removal spell. If you don't have it in hand, we're going to play greedy. We're going gift, to gift you a card. Okay. And I'm going to do drop cure. What's that do? Return up to two target creature cards from my graveyard to the battlefield. And if I pay the gift, if I return at least three. Okay. So, so get a card? And you get a card. Yep, so you get a draw card. And I return three two twos to the battlefield. Yes. Yep. These two guys have haste. I will go to combat. Before combat. Yes, so. Uh, are these the same card right here? Yes. Bioblight? And what's it do? Target target creature and all the creatures with the same name as that creature get negative three, negative three to the end of turn. Okay. Unfortunate. I can only keep one of them, but I guess it's going to probably be enough. I'll pay a white, and I'm going to crumb and get it, but I'm not going to gift it. So it's not getting... Um, actually, you know what? I will gift you. The f we have the mana, though. Five. Can I see that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The problem is you first strike death touch, so the double strike. I'll, I'll give you the food. Take your food. It's not tapped, but. Okay. Um, and give it indestructible. So. It technically doesn't matter which one you target because all creatures share a name. They have prowess. This will still die because it'll only get to three. This will be at five, minus three, minus three. So it's down to a two, two again. Yes. Um, then I will give it 
double strike. So it'll be a 2-2 two -two double strike mm -hmm. combat. And I'll swing what will be a 2-2 two -two double strike indestructible. It will kill your Glissa. Uh, That's... I guess you actually have to block if you... Because it, it would... Wait, sorry, you don't. You would be left I at would one. I would go to one. Yeah, sorry. You'll be left at one because mm -hmm. I did not attack with both. And you don't have any mana, just um, one card left. Sorry, actually, this is Exile. I won't get to play it because I targeted this with a spell. Okay. Um, yeah, I just block it. Okay, so they uh, yours will die, mine will not. Destructible. Wait. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, that's right, because the indestructible. Yes. I'm so not going to block yeah, it. I'm okay, just going to... Gain the life. Yeah, that yes. works too. Here's your food. Yep. So you so go up three, eight. then take four. So you'll go down so to... So go to eight, and then... So I'm at four. four. Yeah. And then I'll pass turn. Big decisions. Those are big decisions. Draw. For me, they're like, wait, God, you guys have monstrous rage. I'm like, no, no, that's my monstrous rage. <laughs> um, there is a spell that could help me with that. Uh -huh. Okay. There you go. Okay. Maha's a, a big birdie. Yeah. Draw. <laughs> Not the card I was hoping for. Okay. Five. Eight. Nine. I can only guarantee like four. Play Mountain is land for turn. Every turn you get is another turn you can potentially just top deck a win or a kill spell. Oh, I'm black and heavy. <laughs> well, like, I can get him up to a 4-3 four, a four, double strike. But that's still only enough to kill Glissa. Okay, so now I know. So I think I have to just pass this turn. <laughs> and hope you don't just destroy my board. I hope I hit the card I need to win. There is one. Sideboard one out. Wait. Drop sideboard two out. <laughs> oh no. There's only one copy of it left in the deck. <laughs> I guess I could hit Mabel. I'm pretty sure this all happens at one time. Probably. So you can't cast that on anything to save it. This is sorcery. Yeah. Carve it. Yeah, you got it. It wasn't it anyways. So I could have cast Ancestral Anger. Actually, let's see. Had I had I been aggressive last turn, I would have cast Ancestral Anger. I would have gotten Ancestral Anger, cast Ancestral Anger again, and then died on a land. <laughs> so it would have gotten plus one, two. So I've only gotten plus three, plus O, oh, and trample from Ancestral Anger. That would have put it up to a one, two, uh, five, seven, which still wasn't enough to kill Maha and Glissa. I was one shy. And then, so Even with the double strike, so yeah, good games. Good games. That was, uh, I mean, so I, the the one card that, because I would have squeaked by. Oh yeah, yeah. I would I would have just squeaked by, giving him trample. So your one one has to block him and then just die. Um, yeah, yeah. But getting double cavern actually really hurt. Like, I, I think I have to drop another cavern out. And I think I'm only going to run two caverns main board because whenever I see two caverns, it's backbreaking. <laughs> because I can't cast half of the spells in my hand if I have caverns because they're instants and sorceries. Oh, we're done here, so bye, YouTube.